Hello and welcome to my arms and abs workout for today. So we're just going to start with a warm up to begin with. So we're going to focus more on the upper body to start off with. So if you just want to bring it into a walk to start. And then just roll in your shoulders, take it all the way back out the height. And then take big stretches, reach your shoulders out forwards. Then stretch the arms out wide, keep marching on the spot. And then stretch it out wide, push low down to the floor behind. Then take one arm closer and stretch the opposite side. Then arms long, make big circles, stretch out forwards and reach out behind. Then feet out wide, arms in close, twist out, reach from side to side. And then arms long, taking it wide from the top, push low down, reach from either foot. And then standing up tall, stretch the arms long, push to the right and to the left. And bring it forwards, push out wide in front, up high into the air and relax it there. Okay, so now we're warmed up, we're gonna get into the main section of our workout for today. So we're gonna focus on the arms first. So we're gonna have five exercises which you could just gonna use your own body weight, and then five exercises which you're gonna include some form of weight. So if you've got some tins or some dumbbells around the house that you can use, then grab them now and put them to one side just for a second. So our first exercise, I'll give you a quick demonstration of the first five, and then we'll have a minute rest, which I'll then show you the five exercises with the weight. So Grab yourselves in mats or anywhere that's free on the carpet. Our first exercise is going to be a lay down push up. So you're going to start up in a plank position, slowly drop your whole body weight onto the floor, flat down, push all the way back up into press up position then. That is our first one. Then second is going to be Superman. So hands to the side of your head, slowly bring it up, slowly drop back down, slowly bring it up, slowly drop back down. Following on to our third, which is going to be push ups on your knees. So try and keep your knees behind, holding your shoulders over your hands, head forward, slowly push your body weight to the floor, bring it all the way back up. So try and get your chest low to the floor before you bring it back up. Then back down onto the floor for Superman reaches, so flat down, head up, look forward, stretch your arms as wide as you can in front, bringing it back, squeeze your blades together, then stretch back in. And then your third one, sorry, your fifth exercise, plank rotation, holding it in the plank position, Rotate round, stretch from arm to arm, bring it up high and wide to the side, okay? So they're going to be our five exercises to start off with. As I say, 20 seconds on each, followed by a minute rest at the end. So, first of all, getting down into that lay down push-up position in three, two, one, go. Hold it upward, push flat down, push up, slowly drop back down. So deep breath in, hold that core strong, drop your whole body weight down, push all the way back up. Good, we're going to Superman's then next in five, four, three, two, one. Flat down on the floor, hands to your head, squeeze your shoulder blades, lift up, slowly drop back down to the floor. And again, deep breath in, pull up, slowly drop back down, all the way back up, and all the way back down. Good. Into push ups on your knees then next for five, four, three, two, one. Take it upwards. Keeping your hands flat to the floor, chest low, push back up, slowly back down, all the way back up. Good. Keep dropping down as low as you can into the floor. Brilliant. Moving on to our fourth and next, Superman reaches. Three, two, one. Again, flatten your chest, hands close, stretch it forward, bring it back, elbows wide, squeeze them, shoulder blades in together. Keep contracting with your shoulders, pull in as close as you can each time. Over halfway then. Plank rotations then for your fifth. In four, three, two, one. Back up, hold that plank position. Body still, rotate from the arms, bring it all the way out from side to side. Good. Deep breaths in, nice and steady. Big rotations round. Keep going then for the last six. Four, three, two, one, and rest it there. Okay, so a minute rest now. <laughs> Grab the form of exercise that you can use. So here's some I made earlier, some dumbbells, just some tins. So 
I'll give you a quick demonstration of all the five exercises now that I'm going to do in standing. So, first of all, chest press, keep them shoulders relaxed, hands in front, reach forward with your dumbbell, slowly bring it back in close to the sides. Then moving on to a lateral raise, arms to the side, reach up to the top, so you lower back down. Then going into a bent over row, hips back, arms high, pull up to your chest, slowly drop back down to the floor. Moving upwards to bicep curl, elbows in, reach all the way up into your shoulders and back down to your hips. And then we're going to lie down for the last exercise, tricep extension, hold your knees bent, arms high, kick down towards your shoulders, reach your arms up high back in front. Good, so we're going to start in five, four, three, two, one, chest press, reach your arms together in front, slowly bring it back to shoulder height then in front. Good, pull them ten muscles in nice and tight, keep them shoulders relaxed, head up tall, keep pushing wide, pull back in close. Brilliant, moving on then into lateral raises for four, three, two, one, arms low by your sides, Reach up to shoulder height, so you drop back down. So again, tummy muscles pull tight. Keep that head up tall. Relax your shoulders down. Keep reaching up to the sides. Brilliant. Well done. Bend over row then next. Coming up in five, four, three, two, one. Feet slightly close together. Hips back. Pull up in towards your chest. Really squeeze them shoulder blades as you pull in behind. Slowly lower back down to start position in front. Deep breath in, slowly release out, you drop back into the floor. Good. Moving on to bicep curl in three, two, one. Up tall, elbows into your sides, pull all the way up into your shoulders, gently drop back down to hips. Good. Keep it up nice and tall, keep pulling up all the way through. Then we're going to move on to the floor then, into your fifth exercise. In four, three, two, one, bring it down to the floor, keep them knees bent, lower the back into the floor, reach of your elbows, bend into your shoulders and then start back up with your arms straight in front. Keep lowering down as far as you can, hold that position nice and controlled, keep going in for five, four, three, two, one and relax. Good. So a minute rest then, we're going to go back on to our first set which is just going to be body weight only. So you can drop your dumbbells to one side for a second or your tins even to one side for a second. Come back down onto the floor then when you're ready. Okay, we've just got over 30 seconds to go so grab a quick drink then if you want one. We're going to go back to our first position then which is a lay down push up. So from lying, push up into push up all the way back down onto the floor, okay? So we've just got this round then once more through and then we're gonna go onto the core round at the end. So get yourselves ready, hold your hands underneath your shoulders and take it up into that plank position. Get ready then in 10. Last bit to go for five, four, three, two, one. All the way down to the floor, push all the way back up. Good, nice and controlled. Deep breaths in, push right to the top, slowly lower back down and push up, gently back down, keep it going. We're going to move then into a superman next, take it up, keep going for five, four, three, two, one. Lower body relax, taking your hands inside your head, reach up, slowly drop back down, reach up, slowly drop back down. So keep contracting your shoulder blades as you push up, keep looking to the floor, pull up, drop down low. Good effort, keep going. Keep lifting as high as you can. We're going to go into a push up on your knees then for three, two, one. Take it backwards, keep them knees relaxed, hands underneath your shoulders, chest low, reach up, chest low, reach up. Deep breaths in, keep lowering down. All the way to the bottom, right way to the top. Good. Into Superman reaches then in five, four, three, two, one. Flat to the floor, hands up high, reach in front, slowly pull back to your shoulders. Keep that head looking forward, keep contracting the shoulder blades, squeeze them as tight as you can. Pull through, reach out. Moving on to the fifth for plank rotation and next. In five, four, three, two, one. Push up tall, contract the entire muscles, rotate with your arms, bring it out wide from side to side. Keep following with your head, look up to your toe, 
reach with your fingertips, pull it out wide. Good, coming to the end of that session then in five, four, three, two, one, relax down there. Okay, so again, one minute rest, grab your dumbbells or your tins, whatever you've got for your weight, and we're just going to go into our last round then onto your arms for the weighted exercises, okay? If you need to, grab a drink. Okay, first exercise is going to be a chest press. So feet shoulder width apart. Quick demonstration again, relax some shoulders down, arms up high in front, pull to your shoulders, then stretch back forward in front. Try and get the dumbbells to touch quite close together into the middle into the front. Okay, get ready then. Just got 20 seconds to go. Hold that position. Shoulders relax, stand up tall, keep looking forwards. And then in the next 10, near there. Start to lift your arms up high in front, and in five, four, three, two, one. Bring it into your shoulders, stretch back forwards, okay? So just really try and squeeze them shoulders together as you reach behind. Keep it to chest height, keep pushing forwards, pull all the way back in close. Good. Keep going. Hold that upper body still. Keep stretching forwards, bring it back down low. We're going to move on to a lateral raise there next, in three, two, one, arms along by your sides, relax some shoulders off. Reach to shoulder height, slowly bring it back down low. So deep breath in, rise up. Slowly lower down, take it back up, and slowly back down. Good, then moving on to our third then for a bent over row. In five, four, three, two, one. Hips back, head high, slight bend to the knees. Keep looking forward, squeeze some shoulder blades in together. Slowly lower back in front of your chest. Good, keep going up. 10, really squeeze to the top, lower down. Six, five, four, three, two, one. And into bicep curl that body up tall. Stay on the spot where you are, keep reaching in close with your arms all the way up into your shoulders. Keep them elbows tight into your sides. Halfway through that. We've just got a line tricep extension then to go next. In five, four, three, two, one. Find your position flat onto the floor, knees bent, arms up straight, lower down to your shoulders, reach all the way back up in front. Good, hold that control. Keep your head down, reach all the way in, stretch back up high. Go for five, four, three, two, one, and relax it there. Brilliant, well done. That's your two rounds done. Okay, so here's the ab section of our workout now. So we've just got five exercises which we're going to do twice through. 30 seconds work and 30 seconds rest. I'll just give you a quick demonstration of our first exercises. Now, you can do these weighted or you can do them unweighted. It's entirely up to you. I'll let you decide. We've got a sit up and reach then to start off with. So I'm going to use the weights to begin with, keeping your arms straight in front of your chest. Feet planted to the floor, hold it up high. Big push up forward, stretch your arms up in front, slowly lower all the way back down, push up, lower back down to the floor, okay? So we have 30 seconds rest after each, so I'll give you a quick demonstration of each of the exercises as we go through them next. So sit up and reach then, I'm just going to set the timer, we're going to go for 30 seconds in 3, 2, 1, go. So flat down, knees bent, arms straight, sit up, reach forwards, gently lower all the way back down onto the floor. So take a deep breath in, keep them arms straight, keep sitting tall, stretch out far. Halfway through then, keep going down for the next 15. Big push up, keep sitting as tall as you can. Last bit to go. Reach down for five, four, three, two, one, and relax for seconds. 30 seconds rest. Leg kicks is going to be next, so lying flat on the floor, arms up straight. Your arms aren't going to move, just your legs, so contracting them core muscles, keep the lower of your back to the floor, legs up high, kick all the way up into your dumbbells then. So, we've got 15 seconds to go, find your position on the floor, maintain that lower back into the floor, arms up straight, don't move them, and get ready in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Alternate legs, big kicks, reach your right to the floor, all the way back up high towards your dumbbells or your tins. So keep kicking down as low as you can. Don't move them arms, keep it still, kick up, lower down, kick up, lower down, good, keep going. 
halfway through. Keep it going. Deep breaths in. Keep contracting them core muscles. Keep them legs out straight. Reach them for five, four, three, two, one, and relax. 30 seconds rest. Moving on to our next, which is gonna be a V sit and chest fly. So you can either do this with your feet up off the floor, keeping your dumbbells in front of your chest, stretch out forward, pull out wide to the sides. Don't move your legs, just hover, holding it up off the floor. If it does pull on your lower back, drop your heels to the floor, try and sit backwards, pull them tummy muscles in nice and tight so you feel contracted, and just use your arms out to the sides instead. So whichever you feel comfortable with, in three, two, one, arms wide, pull wide, slowly stretch back forwards in front. So keep maintaining that position, hold it as strong as you can. Deep breaths in, push close, pull wide, push close, pull wide. Keep holding it up high, Keep holding it strong. Go halfway there. Keep pushing all the way through. Hold it strong. Reach out. Pull it. Reach out. Pull it. Five, four, three, two, one. And relax it there. Good effort. Well done. So lying back down onto the floor for a hip raise and overhead reach. Again, knees bent, feet flat down, arms high. Using your arms and hips together, you're going to reach up with your hips. Lower behind with your arms, pull back down. So overhead reach, pull back in. Overhead reach, pull back in. Okay, so we've got 10 seconds to go then. Keep your heels nice and close in towards your bum to keep their knees bent. Take a deep breath in, and in three, two, one. Overhead reach, hips high, pull in. And again, overhead reach, pull to your shoulders, reach back in front. Keep reaching as high as you can, up and over behind. Keeping them arms long, hips high, keep pushing low. Keep going, deep breaths in, hips as high as you can each time, keep contracting, pull them glutes in, reach up, lower down. Last bit to go. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Again, 30 seconds then. We're gonna move forwards into our plank row for our fifth exercise. So we're just gonna use one dumbbell or one tin. Hold the plank position, get your dumbbell or tin in whichever hand. Holding it still then, all the weight's going to be on the opposite hand. Body still, try not to move your hips, keep it still. Reach up towards your shoulder with one hand, gently row back to the floor, okay? So, in five seconds, we're going to start on the first arm. I'm going to go for 15 seconds on each. Go, push up, nice and steady. Bring it into your shoulder, back to the floor. So hold that back flat, don't twist with the hips. Keep it facing to the floor. Coming up to halfway then, we're going to switch arms. For three, two, one. Move your weight to the opposite hand. Again, try not to twist with them hips. Keep that body still. Look to the floor. Pull up high with your arm. Keep going then. Six, five, four, three, two, one. And relax. Good effort. Well done. So, 30 seconds rest. We're going to perform all of them exercises then just once more through. So, going back to the very beginning. Sit up and reach. Hold it back to the floor. Feet down, knees bent, grab hold of your weight. We've got 15 seconds to go, such a quick demonstration then, arms up, stretch forwards, lower back down into the floor. Okay, get ready then, in six, five, four, three, two, one, go. Reach up, lower down, reach up, lower down. So try and keep it steady as you lower to the mat, really contract them core muscles, make them work hard. Reach forward, slowly bring it back to the flat down. And again, keep it going, over halfway there. Big push up. Keep going for that last right then. Take it all the way in front, back to the bottom. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and relax. 30 seconds rest. Moving then onto our leg kicks. Arms up straight in front, legs in front kick all the way up and down. So you're going to alternate from leg to leg. So we've got 15 seconds, just keep resting then for that next little bit. Grab a drink if you need one. And we're going to head off in 10 seconds then. So arms up high, don't move them. Legs out straight in five, four, three, two, one. One leg at a time, big kicks, alternate from side to side. Keep reaching all the way up and through. Kick up, kick down. Really contract with their muscles, keep that upper body still. Reach all the way to the floor, kick all the way back up towards your hands. 
over halfway then, keep going for that last bit, reach the bottom, bring it to the top, well done, last bit to go, five, four, three, two, one, and relax, breathe up into sitting then next, we're going to go for that V-sit, chest fly, so again, either knees up off the floor, hold your feet, heels up, arms in front, reach wide, or if it does pull on your lower back, rest then heels to the floor, keep a slight bend to the knees, lower back, Put your arms wide, reaching close together back at the front. Okay, so in the next 10 then, we're going to get started. Find a position where you feel more comfortable. And in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Pull upwards, arms wide, bring it back close. Keep pushing all the way through. We've just got two exercises to go then after this one. Reaching close, keep squeezing tight. Pull in, back in, back tight, good. Keep going. Deep breaths in. It's going to start to burn now, but keep holding that position. We've got 10 seconds to go. Count it down. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and rest down. Good. Then lying back flat onto a hip raise and overhead reach. Knees bent, keep the heels close in towards your bum. Arms straight in front. Quick demo then. Hips up, reach behind, pull back close. So bring it in together, lower back down, okay? So get ready then in 10 seconds, we'll head off. We've just got two exercises to go. In seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, go. Hips up, arms back, and again. Hips up, arms back, lower down. Hips up, reach behind, pull in. Good, keep it going. Really squeeze them glutes now, keep pushing as high as you can up into the ceiling. Pull all the way through. Keep reaching up. Work that last little bit to go. All the way to the end. We've just got one final exercise then to finish. In five, four, three, two, one, and rest down. Good. Now, facing forwards, our last exercise then is going to be a plank row. So single arm. Let me just show you for that last time. Plank position, hand in. Reach to your shoulder, drop back down into the floor. So try and keep it nice and steady. 15 seconds on each arm, and then you are done. Okay, get ready then in six. Hands shoulder width apart, keeping them shoulders over your hands. Three, two, one. Hold that position, weight in your hand. Slowly draw it up in towards your shoulder. Again, body still, deep breaths in. Keep them core muscles contracted. Five seconds, and we'll change hands. Three, two, one, opposite hand there, keep maintaining that position, pull up, slowly drop to the bottom, hold it there, push that last little bit, five, four, three, two, one, relax and well done. And then just to cool down then with the upper body, taking your hand, stretch it out forwards in front, Keep your shoulders relaxed, head up nice and tall, keep looking forward to your fingers. Then pull it out wide, push low down into the floor. And bring one arm close in front of your chest, bring your head to the opposite side. And then switch over to the opposite arm. Then bring both hands in together, push low down into the floor. Stretch all the way up into the ceiling. And then arms wide, relax to the side, push low down. And over to the other side. Breathe up tall. Slowly roll your shoulders back out behind. Keep looking out forwards. And then head low to the floor, roll your shoulders in front. And then bring it up tall. Look out to the right hand side with your head. Slowly turn into the left, out forwards to the middle, look up high, low down to the floor, and head up forwards, relax it there. 